hi friends welcome back to the channel so today's video topic is if you are facing this kind of blue screen error your pc ran into a problem and needs to be restart in this video i will show you some troubleshooting steps to fix this issue so before start you have to open your advanced recovery mode so there are two options to open your advanced recovery mode i will show you one by one so let's start with our first option to open your advanced recovery mode. If you are able to log in in your windows, go to this search box and type reset this PC. Click on this option, reset this PC. Now in the advanced startup, you can see the option advanced startup. Click on restart now. So this option will open your advanced mode. So this is the mode we need. Now move on to our next method to open your advanced mode. First, switch off your laptop, press and hold the power key. Now I will show you how to open advanced mode forcefully. So first step is turn on your laptop and now wait for the windows logo. Now press and hold the power key, press and hold to shut down your laptop. Now again, power on your laptop and wait for the windows logo. Wait for the windows logo and do the same thing again. Press and hold the power key to shut down your laptop. Again, power on your laptop again. Wait for the Windows logo. Now you can see preparing automatic repair. Now you have to wait. So this is our automatic repair and this is the option we need. Advanced option. Click on it. Now we can start our troubleshooting to fix the blue screen error. Click on troubleshoot. Then click on advanced option. So the first step, the first method you can try is click on this option startup settings. Then click on restart. Now press F5 key to open your system in safe mode. If you recently install any game, any software or any windows update and after that you are getting this blue screen error. What we are going to do is we are going to uninstall that update or that software in safe mode. Now my PC is in safe mode. Go to the search box and type control panel. Click on this option control panel. In the view by change it to small icons. Then click on program and features. In my system, I don't have much softwares, but if you recently install any software or any game and after that you are getting this blue screen error, simply uninstall that software, right click on the software, then click on uninstall. Or if you recently install any windows update manually and after that you are getting this blue screen error, uninstall that windows update as well. So on the left side, click on view install updates. So these are the windows update, right click on the windows update, then click on uninstall to uninstall the windows update as well. So this is how you can uninstall any software, any game or any windows update. Now move on to our next step. Click on this search box again and type view advanced system settings. Click on this option view advanced system settings. Now click on this advanced tab. Now in the startup and recovery, click on this settings option. Now untick this option, automatically restart, untick this option, then click on OK. Now restart your system and it will fix your issue. If you are still getting the same issue, now move on to our next method. Open this advanced recovery mode, then click on troubleshoot, then click on advanced option. Then click on this command prompt. 
now select your login username now enter your login username password if you are using otherwise leave it blank and click on continue now you have to enter few commands to fix this blue screen error start with our first command sfc space slash scan now so this command will repair all the windows corrupted files type this command then press enter now type the next command chk dsk space slash f space slash r space c colon so this command will repair all the bugs in your disk type this command then press enter now type the next command bootrec space slash fix mbr press enter now type the next command bootsec space slash nt60 space sys type this command then press enter now type the next command bootrec space slash fix boot press enter now type the final command bootrec space slash rebuild bcd press enter now type exit now click on continue and this will fix your blue screen error if you are still getting the same issue now move on to our next method click on troubleshoot then click on advanced option then click on system restore i don't have any restore point in my system but if you have any restore point you have a chance to restore your system to the back date and fix your issue now move on to our next method click on troubleshoot again then click on advanced options then click on startup repair this option will repair all the startup files and fix this blue screen error so as you can see the result startup repair could not repair your pc so this method is failed now move on to our final method you can try go to advanced option click on it click on troubleshoot then click on reset this pc so this is your final or last method you can try reset this pc so in this process you have two options keep my files or remove everything if you select the first option all the data all the files in your system will remain safe but if you choose the second option remove everything in that case all the files all the software will remove so go for the first one keep my files then click on local reinstall so here you can see the options the details reset this pc your system will go back to the default mode all the files will remain safe but the software will remove in this process simply click on reset and it will take around 20 minutes and this option will reset your computer your system this is your final method you can try to fix this blue screen error completely this is all for the video thank you